are very strange puppies. Well, one strange, one not so much. <laughs> You're the funniest boy. Are you going to turn up right now so you look a bit more normal? <laughs> Too cute, baby. You're funny. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> Given this here, I'll really go for this walk, and of course, I've just made a cup of tea. Wait for me, and I just said, I said, do you not want to go? And I said, what? Well, I don't feel the. I should go, but I don't feel the best. He goes, okay, I'll go. And he's gone with the dogs. I am achy. My arthritis is bad again. But I feel funny. He was quite happy to go without me. <laughs> I guess he said he was ready to go. I said, next time send me a message or <laughs> something. So I could not make my tea. He got and got dressed while he was getting dressed. So. I guess it would get system. It's good though, because it um, means that when we're up in Nelson's Bay, he might take the dogs for a walk, which he has never done before. So, that's good. So I'll finish him editing my Boxing Day video at the minute. Okay, a couple of bit today's makeup. So, someone was asking me about my foundation I've been using, and I've been using pretty much this every day. This is you medium coverage, and this is light honey. It's essentially perfect for my face. Um, you just see how as summer goes, I may need a slightly darker colour for the middle of summer when I get more freckles. Um, I've got my Physicians Formula Happy in Rose Foundation. And I've dug out an old <laughs> one I've had for a while. It's a Maybelline Studio Fit. Oh, where's the colour? In Carbon Frost. So I've got that on. Even though I don't like to buy Maybelline, I really like, I've got a few of these sets of shadows and I do find them a really good shadow, just for like a quick and easy one. And I've used my Natio Smoothie in Lollipop. Love these, they are so moisturising, I can't believe how moisturising they are. So I'll show you. So, my eyes. So, and I'll show you my outfit. Well, put my glasses on first and I'll show you my outfit. And I'm wearing my new Killer Green perfume. Okay, quick outfit of the day. It's still drying. I'm just wearing my dress. Different shoes. Got my um, turn it up starfish on. And these little earrings, which I've had forever. I realise now because I've got these gold necklaces, I need to get some um, more gold earrings. And then I'm wearing my arm. Um, uh, that was a bangle bracelet that was my grandmother's, and I, I asked for that when she passed away. About 10 years ago and that was kept for me so that was nice. I don't get to wear it very often but I always loved it and I still love it. I don't know how old it is, probably 20 years old. She had it for a long time before she died. And it's got my little um, hair tie wristbands on as well. In my bag for the movies. I've just done um, my little bags in there and some cordial to have rather than get a soft drink. Okay so on our way to the movies and you might know there's only one child in the back seat. The teenager didn't want to come to the movies. Well, she kind of wanted to see the movie, but she didn't want to go out today. I mean, we're a bit of a, like, do we make it come? Do we not make it come? Those of you that have got older kids, what do you guys do? Is it just an Amy thing? Or is it something that most kids go through? I didn't do that, but I was an only child, so I guess it's probably a bit different. But anyway, I'd love any advice or any input. Because, like, she doesn't want to come on our holiday to Nelson's Bay either. We've said she's got to, but obviously this is just the start start of this so yeah <laughs> not really quite sure what to do are we Kevin? Uh, I thought well, sorry for making her come to a movie I mean she said she kind of said we really wanted to go should go but she didn't want to come so um, wasn't worth it for a movie obviously we're gonna have to work out where the line is where she has to do what she doesn't have to do anyway it would be nice to be reassured that other kids do this too <laughs> oh, we're here at the movies Frozen. Oh, yeah, we're just going to star in the Lego movie now. Well, we just finished the movie. It was really good. Enjoyed it's it. It's funny because the mango was like, gloves. Yeah, Chris, you enjoy the movie? But I can't go like that. She'd look right in the movie. I've got to cut away the, the, the love seat. <laughs> yeah, because we realised you <laughs> can put the armrest up and down. So we're just going to go into Woolworths now and pick up a few groceries for lunch. Okay, we're obviously back to the movies, got things unpacked and just made some lunch. Uh, having another salad. I miss my salad. 
This one's got corn and an egg, pineapple, pomegranate seeds. <laughs> Someone said that we really nice. A few people said they're nice in a salad. And I've just got some mayonnaise. Do I say pineapple? And just some sunflower seeds and pumpkin seeds for a little bit of crunch. So I'm looking forward to that. Oh, I've got another headache, and I just I said to Kim, said you made me a tea. I said, well, that's nice. And I said, I'll have it. This, there's no loose leaf here, so did just give me a black tea. And give me a decaf tea, and we just looked at each other and thought, I wonder if that's why I've got a headache, because I've only had decaf tea today, and then a green tea. Oh, I had a, and I did have one Earl Grey. I had a, um, something French Earl Grey, I think it is. So I did have one, but maybe that's why. I don't know, it's not really bad, it's just, the edge is gone, so. I might need to start drinking more decaf tea. Around. Walked out of the kitchen. Look. Uh, well, I'm, I'm in the middle of the process of changing over our. Oh. No, I'm using the other room, so I'm back in, in here again. This is a good, nice view. Kevin's gone up for a sleep. Amy's just watching TV in there, and Chrissy's just gone to Hannah's. I'm not going to breezy that mum and dad mock the lawns. I don't want to pull the window, it's too noisy, so. Open that window when they have that door when they're finished. Well, I'm just going to try and work on a bit of a plan for my days for the school holidays. Um, it's not to fritter away the day, but I also want to have some time for relaxation and some time for getting jobs done. But I have a lot of jobs I want to get done the holidays because they just don't seem to get done during the school term. And a lot of things need done. Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot to vlog this afternoon. It's not just after six o'clock now, I just realised I hadn't actually done me for a few hours. Well, I haven't vlogged for a few hours. Um, I think I see on the cats the last time I did. We're not doing a couple of blog posts. We've got three blog posts up this afternoon, so that's good. Um, they've just got to do Christmas Eve, Christmas Day now, and then sort of pick up from where, from there. So that's good. And I'm just um, making some tacos for dinner. It's something easy. Using TVP, which I haven't used for a while, kind of gone off the whole idea of it. Uh, but I haven't got any corn mints, so I'm going to see how it is and if I really am off it. While I'm sort of in amongst doing that, I am making some more chia cookies. Because we all know I'm addicted to them. And I ate my last two today. So I want some more for tomorrow morning. I've been a bit munchy today. Um, so hopefully it's just a one off day. <laughs> There's not much, you know, treat food left. But I haven't eaten badly, but I've had a few chocolate. Oh, I've ended up having like two packets of Belvita biscuits because I was looking for food today. I thought I don't want to sell any more chocolates. So I'll go to the Belvita biscuits a bit more satisfying because I had no cheer cookies. So. But had them would have them been happy. So I need to cook some more. Oh, I just watched a couple of episodes of that Orange is the New Black. Not too sure about it though. That's really my cup of tea. I'll watch a few more and then see. So say good night now. I don't have got much footage today so yeah still got and I will probably see you tomorrow.